Hey everyone, I've got this cool tool that I've been working on that I wanted to share with you guys for free. It's um, some free software called Power Grid that I work on at my work. I wanted to do something for the Street Fighter community for a long time and I thought this was a great opportunity to do so. So hope you guys dig it. It's the Street Fighter 5 training assistant. And um, this is something that I personally use because I have a custom stick. So that means I can't map a lot of these handy dandy shortcuts that you can normally get on the PS4 by um, using the touchpad or if you have a if you're a pad warrior using a 360 pad and you have to use the right stick and a bunch of weird hard to remember combinations um, this this way you can use the most important one which is the restart function um, very very easily from your phone so basically you just keep your phone right next to your stick and um, when you want to restart you just hit this restart button um, you have to kind of make sure that it's set up to restart. Um, I also have a button for that there, which you can hit. And that'll just make sure that you're all set. And then when you hit restart, bam, um, it's been restarted. And that's great if you're using Nikali, who has a V-trigger that lasts to the end of the round, because in training mode, you know, that lasts forever. So, you know, that works out really well. Um, I've also added just for um, some more functions, some menus, so that way you can um, hit these buttons you go straight to these menus without having to navigate all these menus manually. You can just go straight to the command list, bum, 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 like that, very quickly. And you can go even to set your controls and a bunch of other things as well. Um, what's really handy is the match settings one. So that way you can just hit the battle settings and then you can set up your online matches. Uh, you can also choose um, favorite character and stuff like that and then immediately be put into these um, menus if you want to switch characters while in training mode. Um, but speaking of match settings, like if you want to report someone to the Capcom Cops, um, Power Grid's great because it has the screen recording grids that have already been made, which have the um, shortcuts that you need to record. So with this one you can use the manual recording option. This is the GeForce um, grid. With the GeForce experience grid you can um, record your matches very easily. With this grid you can manually record just by pushing the manual record button and if you encounter a rage quitter you can just hit the shadow play capture which captures the last five minutes just like the share button on a PlayStation 4 controller and that way you can catch those dirty rage quitters in the act. Yeah and then if you want to install the software it's very easy you just go down to the website install it install the um, host software on the PC Install the um, Power Grid grid, which you can find right here. This is the featured grid at the moment, and you can install the GeForce. Everything will be in the, the description links. But once you're inside the editor, that's where the fun can start. Because if you don't like some of the, the um, buttons, like the favorite character or the favorite stage button, you can um, delete those and then just swap them easily with maybe like the menu record. See how it's in the editor there? I can just drag it over and replace it, which is really cool. So all these grids are completely customizable. You can even record your own uh, macros as well, which is really handy. So I hope you guys um, like that. If you wanna see more features, just um, holler at me and just leave um, some comments down below. And um, I can add some more features to this grid or change it around a bit, swap out some of the buttons, swap out the graphics, whatever you like, or make your own and just you know share them here. That'd be fantastic. And um, yeah, so uh, thanks for watching and I hope you guys enjoy this and um, yeah, I'll see you next time. Cheers.